Hello, good day. I am Father Leopoldo Estioco, OAR, the parish priest of San Sebastian Parish. Okay, San Sebastian uh, started in the 15th century, 17th century I mean, 17th century, and uh, uh, so many churches, about uh, six, including this big basilica, were constructed. However, the previous churches were destroyed by many calamities like earthquake floods, and the, the administration of this community decided to build uh, a structure which is lasting and they decided to build a structure made of steel. Uh, the design, most people uh, said that this design was <coughs> from Eiffel Tower, from Eiffel. However, it was not. No, It was designed by a Spanish architect named Hinaro Palacios. He was the one who designed this and he was the one also who asked or uh, asked for quotations, the lowest bid for this construction and it was in Belgium that he found one. And this structure, this basilica, uh, was prefabricated. It was first uh, built in, uh, in uh, Belgium. They built it and when they found that it was really uh, sturdy and strong, they started to dismantle it and they brought it here to the Philippines. After finishing the structure, this was <clears throat> Uh, approved by the Vatican you know, to become a basilica. Okay? And this basilica was <clears throat> uh, blessed by Bishop uh, Bernardo Nozaleda. Okay? He was the bishop then of Manila and uh, it was in 1891. The, the feast of Mount Carmel falls on July 16 every year. Uh, the feast of San Sebastian the patron of this church falls on January 20 every year. Holy Week is approaching again and the Visita Iglesia will happen again. So Visita Iglesia means visiting Christ in the Blessed Sacrament. Okay? It will happen on Thursday after the institution of the Holy Eucharist when the Blessed Sacrament is transferred to the altar of repose. So when we visit churches, be sure that we pray, be sure that we, pray, we repent, be sure that we invite people to reflect on the mystery of the life of Jesus, that is this Paschal mystery, the passion, death, and resurrection of Jesus. I said, I, I'm celebrating with you in your uh, celebration of the Holy Week, and I also be being with you as we celebrate the resurrection of Christ. Happy Easter.